So disclaimer for those of you who don't already know this about me, but I don't use any tools or techniques to apply product to my hair. So I don't use a brush and I don't use my fingers to twist any of my curls. I don't do any finger curling at all. And the reason that I don't do that, even though I'm sure it would look awesome and I'd be happy to show you guys that sometime, is because I'm someone who is sharing uh, product results with you and I feel that um, a lot of the times when someone's using a technique like that, it's really the technique that's doing the heavy lifting and not the product. And I like to show you the difference that different products do to my actual curl pattern. So on that note, you might be noticing that my hair looks the curls look really, really tight right now. So first of all, before I tell you what products I used, I did trim my, my bangs because I'm growing out a looser curl pattern and my tighter curls have come back and it was just bothering me in the front. So I have these little baby bangs right now and it's just a different look, it's fun. And they're gonna grow, right? So that was intentional, but they did also shrink a lot because of the products that I use today. So I'm using a little bit different products than usual because it's summer in Florida now, it's so humid, and my usual just leave-in conditioner and gel are just not cutting it for my hair right now. So what I decided to use is my Curl Perfecting Leave-In Conditioner, which detangles my hair, it helps to improve the strength of my hair and the porosity. Um, and then I also am using Shaping Putty. Shaping Putty is a super strong hold fibrous putty. It's a cream and it really helps with the elasticity of the curls and with moisture retention. So it's great for if your hair loses moisture easily or if you want your hairstyle to last several days. So this is actually the big size of it and it's still not big right or what you would think of when you think of curly hair products but that's because it's extremely concentrated and you really only need like a fingertip amount for your whole hair depending on what you're going for if you like your hair weighed down you can use more but if you're just looking for a little bit of extra control just add a little fingertip amount to your routine and it makes a huge difference just make sure that you spread it out on your hands while your hands are dry first because you'll see it spreads out all over your hands and that what looks like a little bit is actually a lot of product. And then you wanna work that through your wet or damp hair. The wetter your hair is, the um, less hold it's going to have. And the if it's been a bit towel dried, for example, it's going to have a stronger hold, but also going to have a little bit more weight to it, the less water that you use. And then because this is a product that is more for control and has a little bit more weight than my usual routine, I also used the Volumizing Root Spray, which I just sprayed all over the top, the closest to the scalp section of my hair, like the first few inches of my hair closest to the scalp. Just I just did it in the top layers. So as you can see, this is a super defined, super bouncy, <laughs> If you're looking for your curls to shrink more, it's help you do that for sure. Um, and it will last me all weekend. So um, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys. And I hope you have an amazing weekend. I'll chat with you soon.